You did steal with my boy Slim Thug. Mm. Young hog up the knife, had dreams of riding big. So uh, how was that? And and how did y'all even say, hey, we gonna do this steal? Right? Slim cheating. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. What? I gotta get back to the music a okay. little bit. You did steal with my boy Slim Thug. Mm. Young hog up the knife, had dreams of riding big. So I chased that hard work till I did that shit you did. Mm. That was the last feature y'all mm. just did together. How was that? And and how did y'all even say, hey, we gonna do this steal work? Slim cheating. As <laughs> usual. He, he'll do, he'll just throw something out there. He don't really have he no rhyme or reason. We, we talk a lot about the game. We do a lot of work together, so. It's like got, he just doing it. We got, <laughs> nah. we got a lot of different views. What I mean by he cheating there, that was some songs for the movie. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Why he got the movie, hey, we need a couple songs for the movie. I done it, I'm keeping this one here. Still hustling and still plotting and still scheming. Still chasing the same thing and still dreaming. You know what I'm saying? I got one over there, so man, listen, I'm a, um, it's always, one thing about it, man, it's always an honor and a pleasure to do something, not because of how big he is, not because of what he, he support everybody. Yeah. Hey man, it's seven parties in the city. We all some, he got the biggest platform with the posting and all that. So it, it's important, you know, he's important to have around. It's, it's a, but listen, that don't have nothing to do with it. If it's seven parties in the city in a week, he all seven. Wow. wow. I don't care if you look, he keep all wild propane. He's gonna make all seven, unless he's somewhere. If he in town, he gonna touch everything. From the north to the south From side. the north to the south. So my whole thing is anytime that he, he don't have, me and him do a lot of work in any, anything he ever asked me to do. And that's, that's just, I got him on the new album. Anything he asked me to do, he gonna do it. So I never turn him down for nothing. Man, the verses is smooth too. You come in that thing, man. Yours sound almost like you be singing. You come through singing and rapping, <laughs> nigga. I be like this nigga there, man. I I get caught up in it, bro. Like, right, man, listen. I really, really, I really, really appreciate it, bro. Nah. Keep that music coming, nigga. Do not slow down. Nah, I'm on that you music. Know what I'm, I'm on that music. <laughs> I'm on. Not um, slow I'm down. on a mission. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got a particular goal that I'm after with this music, and um, I got. I want to in the next two or three years. You know, I want to. I want to run that catalog up to about 75 titles. Mm -hmm. I interviewed Bun B and his- uh, I was just about to say- Yeah, Bun, you came up on the interview because- he, I had he, to ask he a question. No, about yeah. the Super Bowl, I had to ask a question. <laughs> if he was supposed to do halftime Super Bowl, um, who would he bring on? And you and know him. He, you know, Queenie, he said, Queenie, yeah, who he you said it's her, her choice. You know, the first name come out of Queenie mouth <laughs> is Lil Kiki. <laughs> or speaking futuristically, you get um, invited to do the halftime show. Right. And that's all yours. Who would you bring on the show with you? What songs would you perform? I, I, I got it. <laughs> See, here's the thing. Here's the thing. When these, these are the type of situations, these kind of things have arisen before in, in my life. Right? I've been given very, very big opportunities wow. in life. And we've always tried to figure out who, are we, who do we right. share this blessing with, right? I, I got to bring in this, if, if that, I can't answer, I know she probably back there like, oh my God. <laughs> I know she back there like, please don't say me, please don't say me. <laughs> but that would, that would definitely be a group decision. That would definitely wow. be a group decision. Miss Freeman, yeah. who, if Bumby gets to do this, let's say the Super Bowl come to Houston, right? They give me the Super Bowl like they gave it to Dre in LA, right? They saw what I did with the rodeo, how I've curated right. the rodeo, exactly. right? They're like, okay, you, you've been able to fill, give an entertaining show in this stadium before, right? What part of that show would you present or what would you create for this show? Ms. Freeman, who are we bringing to the Super Bowl? <laughs> Look, Kiki, Look, Kiki that's my boy. <laughs> see, see, that's biased. <laughs> I was waiting for it. I was waiting for it. That's Why bias. is that bias? Because Lil Kiki is her favorite rapper. That's my Aww. boy. Yeah, Bob was like, you know, Bob said, no, that's cheating. That's cheating. That's your favorite. <laughs> that's your brother right that's there. Us. That's your brother. That's so, us. so, I mean, how did, I mean, did you know that she was a fan like this other music I knew Queenie before on? mine. Okay. So, she always loved the music. Man, I, Queenie been big sister. How did y'all meet? Queenie from outside of town. I've been, okay. I've been knowing Queenie since I'm, 14, 15, you know. Okay. You know, she she OG sister. Oh, you know really? I knew her before Bun. You know what I'm saying? Like for okay. real. You know what I'm saying? Like my 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 partners and Anthony Cove and the Pooch and them, they grew up with 
Queenie older than me. You know, they grew they grew up. Yeah, Queenie big sis for real. So I knew her before. Bob. So she really holding down her side of town. Yes. Yes. On the cruise. Oh, I didn't know that. Before. I'm dumb. I didn't realize what was going on. Show. I'm being played. Right. That's why he said you cheating. Like, no, nah, you can't do that. Because it's nah. really like, yeah, nigga, that's what we, we Queen, go break. Hey, listen, <laughs> when we at the rodeo, we whatever, we honey land, when that south side come up, pfft, it's, up. it's up. Queen rocking. Like, you, talk, know that. you talk about the rodeo, you know, the rodeo, you know, bum preparing for that rodeo again. What can we expect from you? Because I know you're going to have to we be. We don't know, gonna, right? Well, up. listen, let me just be biased with this. I don't care how many more bun, rodeos bun do, and I'm pretty sure you're going to do 75 more. <laughs> if that's what God allowed. That first one we killed. I know. I was there the next day, and I didn't get to. I, I you really don't think care. it's gonna be the same? What? <laughs> I don't Are care. Are even put, better? I don't care if they put ninety five thousand. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't gonna be like that. Nah, but listen, I tell people this with it, man. Listen, from the trio burger to the rodeo, these are the flowers he deserves. Mm -hmm. Wow. He been through hell like us. Mm -hmm. Hey man, this ain't always been peaches and cream. You know what I'm saying? Like so, people are with. How is the trio burger? Great, great. <laughs> it can't be nothing. Else. Great. That was, don't ask me. <laughs> you know, cause <laughs> hey, bro, when I bite it, I I see a thousand more things. <laughs> <laughs> Pocket full of stones. What? <laughs> the, we see everything. The, pimp, the pimp, everything. Jive them contacts. And, hey, well, yeah. I, I'm trying to stay down. <laughs> it tastes beautiful to me. You know what I'm saying? So, I saw Slim did um, a post the other day. He got home because he had a... He had a burger in his pocket. <laughs> <laughs> I laughed yeah, so But hard. see, what I tell people? The favor that we getting from... You know, like, I be trying to get this explained to the youngsters. Because you know, sometimes in the city, the young, they might think we getting all the love. Man, they getting everything. Bro, we went through all the hell. Right. These is, yeah, these is yeah. the reaping of the benefits getting to, hey, we didn't always get to be with the, the Arlers and the Astros and the Rockets. And so for us to become legends and getting to be a part of the social scene in the city and everything. And what the youngsters don't know, it's coming for y'all too. Yeah, That yeah. same torch of work that you're gonna have to hold on, such a, it's coming. So for us, man, I think we're really flourishing in the work that we put in. So not the work, people always think, the hell, yeah. the nose, the, hey man, let me tell you something. I've had a thousand times to quit, be able to quit, if, you know, based on how it's going. Try something else. That's a, hey man, I've wrapped my way out of everything. Everything, but even the stage that you're at now, how, do you still hear a note every now and again? Yeah, motivation. Yeah, we hear. Hey, listen. <laughs> hey, listen. Because people look at y'all like, who will tell little Kiki no? Yeah, we get notes all. Hey, listen. The thing about it is, it's just that I'm better about perceiving it now, mm -hmm. but being receptive to it. You know what I'm saying? Like younger, you know, you getting them no's and it's it's you got bitterness and yeah. Hey, man. I, I because let me tell you why. Because I have to say no. Mm -hmm. So I understand no because I have to say no. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Sometimes and and no ain't always easy, man. Because let me tell you something. I got people who hold been holding grudges since the kindergarten. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And 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 I think sometimes it's easier for them to let your let your grudge go based on how you doing. When you ain't really doing nothing, they don't even got that grudge. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. When you got something going on, we holding. It. Oh, it can go vice versa. You can be doing well, and we'll let the grudge go. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you got some that I'm gonna hold that grudge again because she ain't got nothing going on. Mm. So it can go both ways. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. One on one. Yeah, we gonna talk.